Hello YouTube, hello Facebook. I'm going to show you how to do carbonara or carbonara as they say in Italian. The way to do it in Hong Kong. This is uh, the Parmesan cheese. This is actually grind or grated from the cheese grater. The original piece of cheese is like this. And also, I'm going to show you how to whisk the egg, combine it with the cheese to make the sauce. You're going to crack it. Forget about the white, you need the yolk only. And you do the same with the other egg. Now we're going to whisk the egg. And then we're going to combine it with the cheese. Actually, in Rome, they're using the other kind of cheese called Picorino cheese. It's kind of difficult for us to get access to this Picorino cheese. So what I recommend is more common uh, Parmesan cheese. You need a little bit of salt, just a tiny little bit, some pepper, Pork that we're going to use is a bacon. Actually, most people use guanciale. It's the cheek of a pork in Italy. You need two slices of bacon, belly bacon. And then you're going to use one clove of garlic. Remove the skin, smash it a little bit. That's it. Now remove the garlic. The pasta go in. You are going to need half a level of pasta water. Remember when you boil the pasta, never, never remove all the pasta water. You're not going to need some because this is going to form part of your juice, helps the juice to hug the pasta and it tastes a lot better. Here you go, the lovely carbonara juice, the sauce, whatever you call it. You have to remove it from the heat. It goes like this. Aha. Uh -huh. And then you're going to see a bit of like, lums here. Loosen it with a bit of pasta water. Remember, you use the remaining heat to mix the pasta. Some black pepper again. Oh, lots of them, lots of them. Now you're going to grate some more cheese. That's it. This is my carbonara. My way.